Apparently, America, KK, uh, is so racist that a black man can't even hang out in front of YouTube headquarters anymore. <laughs> okay, so this gentleman that you are looking at, you be looking at before you, is a YouTube executive. And he is in a little hot water because he called uh, the cops on a black man. So let's get into this video. Now you and your son are being recorded. Great. I remember. Can you I remember. Call your friend on the call box and have them come down. They don't have to do that. And you can just walk away. I'm call the police. Oh yes, yes, yes. Call the police. Remember that uh, I remember this exactly happening when I used to live in my own. Okay, so before he gets into his little soliloquy, I'm not um, sure what led up to this. Like, because I mean, he probably just went up to the building and started asking questions of the gentleman, and my man took offense to it. But honestly, the person who's my favorite person in this video is my man's little man. His son, <laughs> like, pop, please don't stop. Kind of. And then people used to call the police all the time. Sir, I'll hold the door here for you. While that you is call okay. Your Nobody's asking you to hold the door. You can do whatever you want. But I'm recording you right now, and you're going to be the next person. Look at this. You don't need to. See, that's the thing I'm not a fan of. Oh, you're going to be the next person that I throw onto the internet and make famous and everything else like that. And I know I'm in a bit of a paradox right here because I'm talking about it. But I'm but there's a specific reason that I, I that I brought that I'm bringing this up and I'm I'm doing a video on this. So just give me a moment. Uh, you'll know in a second. I'm not threatening you. You are. I'm not threatening you. You're going to be the next person. What? You're just going to be the next person on TV. Just remember that. And you have because. Because see, that's the thing. You gave folks a little shine for the big. Uh, what was that? Uh, barbecue Becky or something like that. Like, and so now everybody quick to pull out their camera and be like, Ah, oh, I got you. I want to go viral. It's ah oh, that feminine energy, bro. It's that's real feminine energy. Son, with you. That's why I asked you. If that's your son. It's better. I'll I will delete this. Yeah, there's a trespasser in my building. Daddy, Listen to your son. Daddy, go. It's the better. I, I agree with him, Daddy. It's the better. Daddy, go. Please, I like it. I like it. Daddy. Man, see, uh, I was just looking at my little man, like, yeah, you know what? I, right, we, because, like, yo, like, it's something about a, a kid starting to whine and cry that gets under my skin. And if there's something I can do to stop it, I tend to. But, man, he, he like, there's a, re there's a reason that this guy's on edge. Hold on. And that's the thing, uh, bro, you giggling, but that is like a suspicious move, right? If you sat there and slipped on in after he opened the door, then he, like he's not 100% wrong. I'm like, okay, oh, what's, what's up? What's going on? I tell you to do the dust. Uh, he appears to be African American. Appears to be African American. Yeah, appears to be African American, my dude, because let's be real, nobody knows your lineage, fam. All right? You're like, that's the thing. They like to. Like they they use it as a blanket, African American or quote unquote black as a blanket. So like yeah, appears to be like bro, you might be Jamaican or something. Who knows? Thirty five, software engineer. Polo shirt and a Yankees cap. All good, all good. Software engineer, brother. Pink polo. When a man wears pink, you're supposed to call it salmon. Shirt. Jeans. Yeah. You had to be here for when they call him. He's filming me and refusing to leave, saying I'm going to be the next person on TV. Yes, sir. You don't remember this? The girl that was, like, told? See, like, like, this is what I hate. This is what I hate about the internet. This is what I hate about social media. He's like, oh, the internet. So, you know, okay, so. We are, this is bas This is basically it. His people does come up. But let me explain, let me show you a reason why this gentleman may just be a little bit on edge. YouTube engineer injures eight in drug-fueled rampage via the deputies. This is the gentleman right here, and he's clearly not quote-unquote black or Afri African-American, but, you know, paper bag test, right? 
A delusional YouTube software engineer attacked four friends, including one he stabbed with a pencil, and rammed a stolen truck into pedestrians in an LSD-fueled rampage that left eight people ruined, injured, well, both, in California, uh, authorities said. And let's get back to this right quick. So if you wonder, you're saying like, oh, well, why is he being so on edge? Why is he being so untrusting? There's a, there's actually a very valid reason, but because it, YouTube is hand in hand with the mainstream media, they got that covered up. So now it just seems like this gentleman is just being very um, irrational when honestly he does have a reason to be on edge, particularly when this young gentleman slid behind him in the door like, oh, wait, 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 wait. So he's not wrong. <laughs> like that's the messed up part. He's not wrong. But because they, because YouTube themselves decided, yeah, we're going to keep this, uh, we're going to keep this real quiet, real quiet. Like now it, this could, this is something that they're going to try to like, this is something that could possibly be blown up. That's his home, girl. It took you so long to get here. Daddy, look what you've gotten us into. Let's go. <laughs> That's what. Back in, man. He's like, Dad, look what you've gotten us into. Let's go. And it sucks. It sucks because, uh, like, you want to be, you want things to be like you know, back in the day where you could leave your doors open and stuff like that and you could just assume the best in people. But unfortunately, we live in a time where that is just, that's impossible. In a lot of cases, and it's, it's better to be safe than sorry. That man would not, this gentleman would not want to, uh, you know, read about a, another rampage or something like that and be like, oh, well, I saw that but couldn't do anything, you know? Like... It's a very, it's, we live in a very, in very trying times. And it, this in part does fall on the gentleman who tried to slip in behind them. Like, bruh, like, look, my people's right here. This is all the thing. But nah, he's on some, huh, I, I have self-righteousness in my heart. And this gentleman's being racist towards me. And it's like, bruh, come on, fall back. I, I, there, nobody's hands are clean in this situation. Just give me one second while you're being an asshole to in front of your kids. Okay. Remember, I'm recording you. I'm fine. And see, now he's being, like, now you kind of hear it in the gentleman, right? Like, oh, I'm recording you. And don't be an asshole. And he's, and as you can hear, he's going to start cursing more because he's feeling very vindicated now. Like, oh, well, I told you, sir. So, honestly, I, I don't think that we need to go further into any of this. Um, ultimately, there's like, there's right and wrong on both sides here. I completely understand why this gentleman was like, hey, what are you doing? Uh, but at the same time, the other dude was just very, very like self-righteous in his indignation. Like, uh, you're going to be the next person on film. And it's just like, bro, come on, calm down, man. It, it ain't had to be like that from either, from either, from really from either side, you know, but it is what it is. It's the world that we live in. So with all that being said, all the internet stuff, if you like this, toss me a like or a dislike. I'm not scared. Sub if you enjoy my fantastic voice and you want to get videos of interesting stories like this every day and some boring news jersey stuff because that's where my heart is. Uh, share because sharing is caring and YouTube's definitely not going to share on this one <laughs> and speak. Let me know what you think in the comments uh, was that, like after having the uh, context of the um, of the situation that took that took place with the YouTube engineer. Can you really blame this gentleman for being a, just a smidge more on edge and then seeing somebody slipping behind them and being like, oh, hold up, pause, wait. Let me know what you guys think in the comments and until the next one.